Good morning everyone, I am Dr. Shakrabhastha, MDGM Clinical Pharmacist and today I am going to talk on Multiple Sclerosis Management and we all know that Multiple Sclerosis is the most common cause of chronic neurologic disability in young adults and its prevalence is 1 in 1000 and the symptoms of Multiple Sclerosis is numbness or weakness in one or more limbs, uh, tingling, L, Hermite sign that is electric shock sensations during neck movements, lack of coordination, unsteady gait or in inability to work, partial or complete loss of vision, vertigo, cognitive problems, mood disturbances, etc. And to diagnose multiple sclerosis, we can use biomarker tests, spinal tap that is lumbar puncture, MRI primary regional imaging test, evoked potential test, etc. And the drugs used in management of multiple sclerosis are corticosteroids like oral prednisolone and intravenous methyl prednisolone, glatidam or acetate, monoclonal antibodies like ofatumumab injection, natalizumab, ocrelizumab, that can be IV infusion, alemtuzumab, it is also given infusion, and teriflumamide, dimethyl fumarate, monomethyl fumarate, fingolimod, siponimod, ojanimod, ponesimod, cladribin, amantadin, dalfamridin, etc. These are the drugs we can use in multiple sclerosis, but uh, we should be cautiously use these drugs and the drugs to be used cautiously according to the guidelines. Thank you very much. Yeah, I got it, man.